with some stories that don't involve bars, but they mostly do. So now it's my turn to get my computer running. How's everyone doing? How's everyone doing? That's a good battery. Right? Just so many cables. Yeah, it's 2012 and we haven't solved this problem. It's great to know.
be forward looking. And as soon as I saw, you know, I searching for forward looking, it's people forward looking, it's always to the right, isn't it? It's like, that's clearly look, look really backwards. It's like the graphs have to go up and to the right in America, so forward looking, not backward looking. Um, but also talk about ideas, right? Because there's this um, pervasive thing that I have to pay for my house and my boat and my plane. Using <laughs> ideas. So I have a few ideas in this presentation to bounce off of you to see if you'll you'll become investors. Um, I was recently, I went camping in Utah, and there are these 12,000 year old ruins down there where there's lots of cave paintings. Um, and a lot of it's still intact, right? But the, the weird thing is that a lot of the people had uh, six fingers. And they had six fingers because of inbreeding. So of course, what we need to do is make six fingered gloves. That's my first idea. Any investors? <laughs> See, this is what I mean about the underdog. It's like an early idea. But I assure you we will make <laughs> So the, the basic vision behind OpenStreetMap is to be the world's most up-to-date, complete, and universal map. A bit like Wikipedia is, you know, why would you use another encyclopedia? Um, and the best route to get there, I think, or I thought since I do, is to make it open and free. The project's very global. Um, I mean, there's people from, I, I hope, every continent apart from Antarctica here. Uh, it's like